Do not order me, do not cut. You understand? Idea. You have respect. Have respect. I am going to India. 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 We received instructions from our friend, Mr. Jimmy Wanjiki, that the police wanted to meet him. Uh, we were not told specifically for what reason they wanted to see him at home. But what I do recall is that we had, we had appeared before a judge of the High Court who listed this matter for mention on 19th of September. My advice to Mr. Wanjiki was that we should comply and find out why the police want to see them. They gave us time, 2 p.m., exactly 2 p.m., we were in the office. We talked to the senior investigating officer and he said that he now wanted to take a statement from Mr. Wanjiki. We were a little bit surprised because that's not what we had been told before. We had not been given any notice at all. And we had obtained orders in the High Court stopping any arrest or interfering with his liberty. So we were able to convince the senior investigating officer that what they were trying to do was not proper. And uh, in fact, at some stage, he shook his hand with Mr. Wanjiki, and our understanding is that we were now able to leave this office. But strangely, another person now came, another senior officer came, and he started talking about the guns that Wanjiki, they wanted to carry out some searches in Wanjiki's home about guns and so on. Now, I told him that we had no I had no instructions about this story about guns at all. And he should tell us when he would like to see us. Tomorrow or sometime this week, we would then come when we have been properly instructed on the issue of guns. Now he told us that he was now going to carry out the for quite some time. Then one senior investigator just came and said to us that, look, we are taking on GK to court tomorrow and we are putting him in custody. I asked him whether he should not give him bail. He said bail is out. To me who has been at the law for a long time, what is happening is despicable. That is not the way justice should be administered at all. And tomorrow morning he will be appearing in court. What exactly? I uh, we don't know. I, I think it must be in chief matters court mm -hmm. and at uh, Milimani. Wakili, in regards to the court order that was issued uh, to stop his arrest, yes. and also as we are concerned, mm -hmm. are still in force. Mm -hmm. Those orders are still in force. But what is happening now is despicable. That is not the way justice should be administered at all. Things are happening which used to happen during Moya administration which I thought as a country we have now got 